So I initially got a phone call from Lee Farah back in the fall of 23. And she explained the situation, what had happened, basically uh, went under contract with uh, a pool builder. He was really slow to respond back. And anytime I would ask him about a timeline issue, he would always say, we'll start next week. I'll be there first of next week. That was kind of his answer for everything. And then the first of next week would come and nobody would show up. The builder went in, dug a hole, but never followed through beyond that. So I'd called a couple of companies that were reputable around here. And I found Ray's premier pool and spas. And I just gave him a call one day and kind of explained the situation, what was going on. So Megan and I talked about it. We prayed about it. We, we batted it around for a long time. And we just kept coming back to somebody has to help these people. If we can help one or two or three of these families and get back on their feet with a pool in the backyard, and maybe turn these negatives into a positive, that was the goal, that was simply it. And at that point, we just said, you know what, let's just do this thing at what it costs us, uh, pitched it with them, and uh, Steve finally got on board and that started the process. This is amazing. The things that Ray and Megan are doing for us are just, I can't even put it into words. This is so awesome. Now I'm crying. <laughs> this is so good. So good. The shell arrived and I cried. <laughs> I was overwhelmed watching it come in. It had been a hole in our yard since the 2nd of August the year before, and seeing that truck pull around the corner, I cry now, um, with the pool finally on it and knowing that this season in our life was about to change and change for the better, it was a major relief. It felt like dreams were finally coming true and we were gonna finally be able to make those memories that we had planned. You know, I, I love my wife, uh, I love my children, but it was an emotion that I can't put into words. It was really seeing Lee and her coming up to me, giving me a, a crazy hug with uh, so much emotion. I mean, really bawling her eyes out. And it's crazy because it's a pool. And I think that it's easy to get lost in the day to day of, you know, we're trying to put pools in everybody's backyards. And but when you see a woman who took their life savings and put it into a project that didn't even net them a shell of something to swim in and then get to today where we're watching the pool crane over her, her house and, and then standing in the pool shell getting photos made with her, it was uh, is incredible. It's exactly why I want to do this for many years to come and I'm just I'm grateful. I can't stop smiling thinking about the fact that we finally have a completed pool. <laughs> it feels like so much weight lifted off our shoulders. It's been such a burden. I look forward to making lots of new memories back then. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna push my kids in the pool. Sometimes it's easy to get caught up in the finances of things, but I think what Megan and I felt, and we never did this for any reason other than just that it felt good to us, it felt like the right thing to help someone who's been wronged. Uh, again, just blessed and grateful to, to be part of the Premier family and, and have the opportunity to help people. grateful 
for everything that Ray and, and Premier Pools has done as well. You get to enjoy pool, man. <laughs> <Hi>. <laughs> If you love amazing pool transformations, subscribe to our channel. We'll be bringing you new content all month that you won't want to miss. Join our splashing community, follow along and get inspired. Who knows, your dream pool could be next.